Hi guys and welcome back. Alright, so today it is going to be a passion twist tutorial video. I wanted to show you the time because I wanted to highlight that I'm doing my hair at 2.23 a.m. So if my face look puffy, you know why. This is a braiding pattern. I did single braids on the sides, both sides, along with the back, and then I did cornrows coming straight down. Why? Because when I catch up my hair, I want it to be seamless and flawless. And based off of the reviews that I saw on YouTube, it would be best to do your hair like this if you want to catch it up, you see me? So when I did the corner straight back, like I said, I did some individuals at the back. Also, three rows of that. I'm going to just put everything in the center right there. So, so yeah, I'm never bother showing the whole McKinney or the hair or anything like that. Because guess what? This is my second time doing this hairstyle and I was kind of over it. Maybe that's why I started at two in the morning, but yeah. Anyways, I'm using this pack of hair that I got on Amazon. Um, the pack of hair comes with eight of these single packets. And in the single packet, I think it's about eight twists come in each of these. Yeah. So, I never bother twist me here this time around. I did it the crochet method way. Now, I don't have a technique as to how to push the latch up to your ear so that the knots not show on this and whatever. I don't think it's that serious. So, this is what the first row looks like. Pretty neat, pretty good. I like it. I think it came out really well. The back part, that is. And it looked like me. I'm not able to catch up my ear when I'm done. So I'm going to continue doing the back just to kind of get my groove and see how I like things. So far, I really, really like this hair. I like this crochet method passion twist. The only thing I didn't like about it is that... Alright, so we get to that in the end part. I'll tell you about that when we're done. But yeah, see, it seems as if the hair I will catch up really nice. This didn't take very long to do. It's pretty simple, quick and easy. I really like this method and I really like this hair to the point that I saved the hair. I still have the hair because I want to try another style with it. So the hair is reusable. See, me catch it up and it seems as if it ever work. The hair is reusable. So I'm going to try another style with it. So stay tuned for that video. But yeah, it looks very full and I love the color. It's very pretty. And yeah, so I'm just going to show you guys. I'm going to speed up the whole process because I want you guys to see how it's going to turn out. But so far, so good. I'm loving it. It looks full to me. All right, so at this point, I was finished with the packs of hair that I got. So I had that much left over and I didn't have any more hair left. So I'm showing you what I'm working with so far. I probably could have finessed it and get away with it by just catching up my hair like that. But because I wanted to wear my hair down, I was going on vacation, so I wanted to wear it down. So at this point, it's 4.17 a.m. 
and I ran out of hair. What to do? What to do? You guys remember that passion twist video that I did? How to not do passion twists? Well, guess what? I didn't throw away that hair. I started to crochet that hair into my head because I didn't want to have this bald spot at all. The only thing with it is that it is black and the hair that I have in my head is brown. So it kind of didn't match, but and I, anything to get this bald spot out of my head. So this is the longer method to do it. Crochet it in and then twist it. That did take a really long time, but I had to do something and I wasn't gonna wait to, to reorder the hair. I've done the hair at least twice already, so I was kind of frustrated and you know, I just wanted to get it over with at this point. I was so tired and I had work the next day, well, that same day. So that is what I had to do. I had to do that to finish my hair. By this time it's morning and it's time to get ready for work, but I'm glad I finished. And I am absolutely loving it. The only downfall I have with this hair is that it came with a scent. So you have to, if you want to, you can wash it and um, have it smelling all fresh again. And the other downfall, it has nothing to do with the hair. But like I said, I went on vacation and I went into the pool, into the beach, water and um, yeah, it did kind of, it never worked out. It was heavy and it was full. I mean, don't believe the hype that you see on social media with people that do them air for God Beach and them something there. It not going to work out as far as me concerned. But other than that, I love the hair. So I want to try the hair again when I'm not on vacation. It, it was lightweight. It was very lightweight. It never really did a break my neck or anything like that and it was full and I love the color. I absolutely loved everything about this hair. Movement, body, bouncy. It's th synthetic hair but you know it really did the job. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video and subscribe for more and watch the other videos that I put up. As always, enough love, big up yourself, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.